truck rather than white horse Yukon? Mike and Mike, what job is more cooler than yours? Sounds perfect. Okay, because you know, this paddling you're at, it's starting to get a little like whoosh. Yeah, right Okay, so what do you think? The question is, any job cooler than ours? None. Oh, wait. <laughs> well, I don't know. There's a couple. There's a couple there. Right, it's just a choice. Well, I liked the uh, lighthouse keeper. I thought that was you take lighthouse keeper. Kind of funny. Contemplative, not much work. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I go for blowing stuff up. Ah, uh, yeah, I like the bombs, flying helicopters, and blow stuff up. That had a lot of toys with it. Yeah, let's yeah, go with that. That's good. Yeah. But uh, all in all, you want to keep this one. I'll keep this one for a while. Is this okay? You're getting enough breeze? I'm getting enough breeze. Are you comfortable? Yeah. It's only a matter of time before they catch us, though. <laughs> Hi, in the Kootenai Pass in British Columbia, just outside of Salmo. So get your little atlas out. Yeah. yeah. Hi. Yes. In yes. an avalanche area. We are in an avalanche area. <laughs> This would be the, the shoot sector that this gun would take care of. Everything you're looking at uh, up into the starting zones would be covered uh, with the launcher. You take the safety off here, and then the gun is ready to fire with this right here. Uh, actually, let's not show people how to fire. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You know what? You know what? People watch our show and how to fire it. Right? Don't do this at home. Yeah. And don't do it here. Yeah, don't do it here either. <laughs> The most important person, I think, in our seafaring heritage of this country is the lighthouse keeper. There's a romance with this, this beacon of light that sheds hope and a lending hand to the lonely sailor out there who's probably his only sight of land will be this little blink of light, blink, where he can remember his loved ones. And that's why I brought you out here to, re to discover and learn about the romance of the lighthouse and, of course, the lighthouse keeper. Why don't we talk to you for a minute? You want a TV? Yeah, yeah, let's continue. Oh, yeah. We were just uh, just sort of philosophizing and thinking about, you know, how great it would be out here and uh, romantic to be, you know, out here with the ocean in the background. Where are you, where are you from? Uh, we're kind of Toronto. Oh, yeah. 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 Do, you, do you find it romantic and um, exciting to be at this remote bastion of safety, I guess? Uh, Oh. Is the responsibility of being the last bastion of safety, a beacon, a shred of light, a shred of hope to the lonely sailors out there whose only sight of land could be, is your, your little uh, glint, glint of light? It's a gig, you know, it's a gig. Work like about five minutes a day. I, I just switch it on. Uh, when it gets pretty well when it gets dark, I switch it on, and then in the morning, uh, when it's no longer dark, I uh, usually just come down and chuck her off there. So it's uh, it's put in, you know. But by using this experience of being the beacon of light, the yeah. hope for the forlorn sailor, bringing him home to his family, yeah. do you think you could apply that enriching experience to uh, what you would apply to, say, if you did move to the city? I, sorry, I don't know what you mean. Well, we should blew the bundle on that, eh? Yeah, well, maybe next time. Somebody might consider getting some animation to do that instead, uh, do I think? I used, to, I used to work on this my whole pen. I was thinking maybe we're congratulating each other because we made it to, to all ten provinces, both territories. And Labrador. And Labrador. And Labrador. Don't all, forget that. All everything. in the same show. So I think we, you know, we covered just about everything. Do you think uh, Order of Canada? Yeah, you know, the only problem with the Order of Canada is you got to be nominated by somebody else.